Hey, today I'm going to be showing you a brand new rune glitch in Lake of Rot in the latest Elder Ring patch. What we want to do is head over here towards the Eastern Tableland. Once you have located the Lost Grace, we are going to then head directly forward and then take a left because we want to locate a corpse. We eventually will end up coming across a monk camp. This is good news because we will want to go towards the left side and take the mountain up and then drop down and grab the item from the corpse. I'll show you a good example of how this is done right here. Let's go ahead and take a left. You will then go forward, go up, then locate the item down below, which will be right next to the corpse. We will drop down and quickly grab it before we end up being striked by one of the monks, like so. Now that we have the spell, we can then head over towards the Lake of Rot, interact with the Lost Grace, then you'll want to memorize the spell Flame Cleanse Me. Once you have that, go towards the Lake of Rot, drop down below, and then once you see that you've been affected by the Rot, use the spell. This will completely remove it. This will then allow you to go to each structure, and what you should see next to it is a plate. You simply want to walk over this and press it down. What you should see is some structures that will rise from the Lake of Rot. You will hop on top, and then head towards the south. You will want to rinse and repeat this towards each structure till you're able to reach the other side. What's going to happen right now is I'm going to remain commentary free until I reach the other side here and then we'll start talking about the rest of the glitch. So, here we are. If you look on the map, you can tell that right here there's a Lost Grace. All we have to do is walk straight forward, interact with it, claim it, and we are now going to be able to proceed on towards the next step. Note that if you interact with one of the bosses on the left side, you will be able to pick up another item within this glitch. And when I mean interact, I simply mean go up to the boss so that the health bar pops up for him. You'll then make your way back towards this Lost Grace on the map. Note, you do not want to fast travel towards this Lost Grace. Once you have interacted with the boss, you want to make your way here by simply walking over here. Let's say that you are here, you will jump towards the northwest, then continue forward. We are going to do the offhand swap. You will want Merica's hammer on the right and Uchikatan in the left. Try to use your mount, hit the ashes button, pause the game, and then swap over towards a weapon that has the spinning weapon ashes. If you need a complete guide on where to find these items, check out yesterday's video or the one prior and I show you how to find these. What you can do now is head straight forward towards the west and we are going to go around these pillars. You can simply jump forward but I just kind of like going in between like so. It's really up to you how you want to do this. 
make your way all the way towards the end here and do not go towards the right and do this because if you drop down below on the right side you will end up falling to your death what we are going to do instead is go towards the left so that we are facing south continue forward then take a right so that you are now facing towards the west we are going to walk forward and we should land on top of this building that's underneath we can then go forward again and we should land softly without any health being taken away continue towards the west then go towards the left side here and let's do the offhand swap this time with the staff of the avatars or if you have a weapon with ground slam you can use that as well we will rinse and repeat what we have done prior we will try to use the mount then hit the ashes button which will be l2 then pause the game go down replace the uchi katana with the spinning weapon then from there hold down l2 or v or if you're on pc it will also be shift and right click you want to hold this down right after you've done the offhand swap if done correctly you will see a bunch of runes pop up remember to hold down the l2 all the way down and there you go and with that being said i hope you guys have enjoyed the video appreciate everyone that is currently a member and is a subscriber i love it so much and i hope that you have the notifications on and i'll see y'all in the next video